guys welcome back to the channel in today's video we are actually gonna meet up with my buddy who has a 21 Toyota Supra with JB4 on it so he's gonna bring that by we're gonna go for a ride check it out bring you some uh, untunable Toyota Supra content now he can get his ECU cloned um, that is the route he can go but a lot of the 21 22 guys usually go JB4 so that's why I want to bring you this video give you his thoughts so far and kind of re review his car so he should be here in about I don't know five to ten minutes I'm thinking and we also give him a ride in my car. If you guys enjoy it, also we're about to hit a thousand subscribers. I really appreciate all of the uh, support on the channel, guys. If you like this content, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. We got a lot more content coming this summer for you guys. Stay tuned for that. What's going on, man? Oh, you just parked out back here. And I was like, I forgot to state the gimbal, <laughs> so I went back. So you got the JB4 on and the intake? The MST intake, yeah, that's been a lot of fun. And I'm curious to see how the wiring looks for the JB4. You notice a big difference in power? Oh so yeah, far? definitely. Yeah. Uh -huh. I got it on map two right now, okay. so plus four pounds of boost. So, that's off the shelf, yeah. Okay, and then I know Jesse does a lot of stuff. So, so I'm MST. Gonna reach out to him, yep. Yeah, you can't even really see like where you ran your JB4, I guess, around here? No, so it, it plugs into the wastegate down there. Okay. I got why I can even pop this off. Uh-huh. So wire for the J, uh, oh. wastegate comes yeah. up here, and I got it. Got the JB4 plugged into this sensor and this sensor, run the wire over over to here, and then I got the JB4 tucked, tucked, away. tucked away under there and yep. connected via Bluetooth. Definitely excited to see how it feels. I know it'll feel punchy. Yeah. You I know, unless you know what you're looking for. Off. And no check engine light, correct? And no correct. check engine light. Because right. it's still catted downpipe. Still catted downpipe, yep. Stock uh, downpipe. Stock, stock, everything else is stock, stock exhaust, stock tires. Yeah. These are just the first two two mods I've done. What do you think about going catless? Yeah, I don't know. If, uh, if it avoid, I think I'd get a check engine you light would. If, if I do that. So right. uh, I'm looking at Auto Works catted downpipe. Uh, maybe as my next thing, right. but I, I got to get wheels. So what would you say the power bump is? Uh, so here's interesting. I have statistics on this. Okay. I took, took this to um, Maryland International Dragway uh, Capital Auto Club, did uh -huh. a, uh, a drag day, and I ran a 12.4 at 115, which is pretty stock numbers for this. And I just did use my draggy with the MAP2 um, tune and mm -hmm. uh, over on set did a little pull <laughs> yeah and uh, dropped down to 1190 nice. yeah at, at 119 so yeah. uh, de definitely uh I know exactly where you're talking about on yeah. cons. Uh, right there where all the burnout marks are, exactly. right? Yeah. It's a good straightaway. This is an Instagram, guys, if you want to follow him. And you've had the car now, what, a year? C getting close to a year now, yeah. Nice. Coming up on that anniversary. So yep. I got, got a vision for the car. I haven't quite achieved it yet. R wheels, tires. Yep. Very familiar. Uh, yeah setting here oh you did the carbon fiber on the dash this, yeah, I that's... did the red star okay button. yeah that looks pretty nice yeah it was a pain to get out it always feels so different in the passenger seat <laughs> way quieter than yours yeah that was in sport mode yeah yeah we'll go for a ride of mine after <laughs> A lot more noise. A lot more intake noise. Yep. Yeah. I almost um forget how punchy the stock turbo is. <laughs> it's not bad. No. And a little bit of like uh, I think you could do like an ethanol blend on this. Yeah, I saw E30 is possible with the JB4, right. but maybe I gotta get Jesse involved. Right, yeah, he's the go-to guy. Yeah. Yeah, you can do a nice little pull here. Oh yeah. Yeah? Feels 
That's good. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad at all. Good. Yeah, it does. You're right, it does have a little bit of that flutter. Yeah. Yeah, that I was surprised about. Honestly, that's more of a uh, power increase than I was thinking on the really? stock downpipe. Okay. I mean, I knew it was going to be something, I just didn't know it was going to be like that. I don't know, it, it feels different than maybe what the numbers suggest. We just went for a quick ride. Honestly, I like the way it feels down low. It's pretty punchy on stock turbo. Honestly, JB4 is probably the way to go for now on a locked ECU. Thanks for showing me your car. Yeah. And uh, now we're going to go maybe for a ride in my car. It's a nice sound without being too obnoxious. Yep. 